so much for watching Tomohita music. Finally, Pom 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 by Carrie Pian Pian. I can't really say her name. And okay, already I made this video a long time ago, but again, this new camera and new uh, microphone, thanks to um, Guitar Wisdom, we got this microphone for me. And so um, thank you so much for supporting Guitar Wisdom and music here um, in Tomohita music. And so this song, a Japanese artist, Kari Pam Pam, I, I'm not sure I'm pronouncing right or not, and Pom Pom Pom. Many, many, many years ago, and uh, you know, I mean, I always go to Japan to do touring and clinic, and you know, way back from Japan, always what I do is I listen to all the Japanese music, to current Japanese music, and just skim through each song, anything, if I like bass line, harmony, melody, I just listen so this one probably, at least I probably listened 30, 40 times, really. And then figuring out melody, chords. So the, um, well, we get into, you know, uh, melody, but the first always important to understand the chords. And so I thought maybe I can figure it out the simple way to do. So like, um, so I did the, so this is A major seven. I play with my thumb too, you know, okay, right, root, fifth string I mute, and then I have a four, three, two, first finger on, seventh, sixth, fifth, and fourth frets. And so, uh, okay. So at first, I just learned song and then figure it out theory-wise. So first, okay, A major 7, then, and then, that's like, you know, um, G sharp minor 7, half step down. And then, I'm not sure this is correct, but uh, I've just made up maybe, A over B. And then C sharp minor seven. So already sounds like a C sharp minor, C sharp minor or relative to E. So I always think two way. I don't just think minor, minor and major kind of you know um, share the room together. And then not necessarily I just uh, you know like like one or not. It just I like both. You know I like both. And then um, I just share. So this case this case. I can understand if you think a key of E, which is a theory again, key of E, then A is four chord, four, and then half step down from four chord is three minor, and then this is a four over five, which is a five, and then six minor, which is a, you can see, think of one minor, you know, okay, to key of E. This way, just you know, categorizing, you know, four. Three, four, five, and six minor, one minor, you know. Then I made a. 
So listen to that. And then what's going on? How many instruments here? This is my basic way to make a loop for fun. So guitar, I always use kanji guitar, middle pickup, dry, see? No reverb. That's the first thing I do. Next, I use country bass to play bass line. Like that. Then I use both uh, dimension C chorus and a little bit delay and I finger pick like that. Like a keyboard. In the airplane, figuring out the melody with the headphone. So then I noticed already it's more than I would play, a lot of notes in it. Okay, you know. I love song that I can play from open string to 12 frets because that's the best song. I can show you more song here. So like that, um, okay. So that's e, so basically I'm playing E major scale around B string. Like that, I can play it well, but okay. So then... Melody right away, she is not improvised melody. Somebody gave her melody, she learned note for note. So, when I listened, you know, great melody in song in airplane, uh, I have a theory if I hear the melody that kind of move around, I cannot hear the right pitch, I skip them because not important for me. I just want to hear the melody because melody is really important for guitar to play listenable and somebody can hear and somebody can really uh, understand what's enjoy you know so anybody can play kind of bluesy or something fancy but then if you hear you cannot tell who's playing the melody is really important okay so now the the then That's really important. So, so, so. Then. Ta 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 ta. All right, I take that. Ta 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 And then of course I you know when you transcribe I just figure out you know a lot of different fingerings but 
once I figure out the one octave, I love to play on the one string because it's a little difficult to play. So difficult to play so that my rhythm, it's a little bit behind, right? It's not always on time because it's a little difficult. And if you don't think well enough, then you hit the wrong note. You cannot play by feel too much. You have to really understand the pitch. So that gives almost I'm playing trumpet or piano, kind of thinking about what notes to play. Guitar player, what fingers to use, you know? So I away from what finger to use, what notes to play, and then relate to theory, always, always thinking about intervals against the chords. So that really important. Okay. Now I'm going to play this backing track again for later. I think if I make a backing track, why not very later on the video, I'm going to play a little longer so you can capture that with a cell phone and then maybe loop that one. How's that sound? All right. And then, okay. So, so that, so you have to really practice melody in the beginning. I play melody, right? So then, um, okay. So how about this do re mi? And then that's normal. I just use my uh, one control, uh, Prussian blue reverb. This covers all mistakes really nicely. You can hear any mistakes. And so now I use this um, uh, what's it? little copper chorus. It's a chorus by one control, but almost almost uni vibe. It's really nice. Okay, so now I... Scale, 
uh, once in a while people say avoid the notes and fourth, 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 you know, but again, the notes is okay as long as you don't stick to too long because if you have, you know, one chord, I'm oh, sorry, you know, fourth notes, if you stay a long time, it's not really sounds good, but you have to experience, you have something, you have, to, you have to play those notes that don't work in a certain place, you know, so you have to understand. So I want to really examine this chord of progression. play but don't play that song that's McDonald This has nothing to do with this. Then. I just felt it. Because this song
I promise. So I'm gonna play a little bit of um, backing track for you so that uh, you can uh, record it. There you go. How's that? Long enough? I hope you enjoy. So, I showed you today Pom 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 by Kerry Pam Pam. I can say that. Kerry Pam Pam. Alright. Thank you so much for watching Tobon Fujita Music. If you want to learn more foundation, technique, all the details I teach at My Guitar Wisdom, please join and please subscribe. Tomo who is the music here and make sure ring the bell to hear when I post new video. Thank you and always always appreciate your comment below here what you thought about this video so that I can make a better video. I'm really working really hard right now. It's from May um, this summer I'm gonna really make a better video for you and let's do that and uh, thank you so much for your support everything. Thank you. So see you soon. Bye.